Hi, I'm Dr. J.B. Askew, practicing pathologist in Houston, Texas for close to 40 years. Pathologists have dreamed over the years about the ability to look at slides remotely and control them at, while they're sitting at their desk. As an example, we now have a way, thanks to Rob Meyer in Houston, Texas, of Meyer Instruments, to look at slides on a frozen section or whatever um, the status is of the slide uh, remotely and drive the slide in my own office. I've actually done it myself. It's easy to use and is being showcased at Meyer Instruments here in Houston, Texas. This is an actual profile photograph of the M8 instrument. This is the action shot showing the slide being put on the stage. The M8 at first makes an overview showing uh, the tissue slides. Then the lens will descend and start taking images of the tissue only. When the light starts blinking, the image is being scanned. Uh, the next uh, image that you will see in this demonstration is the actual frozen section. Here is the actual frozen section image. This is Rob Meyer actively looking at the scanned image. He can size it and he's actively moving it along to examine the deep line of resection. As he does this on the left, the M8 is blinking, keeping up with his uh, request uh, for tissue examination. Now, look what you can do 40 miles away. So here we have now the um, whole mount of a, a frozen section. This actually is a frozen section, but not one done today. And so we can uh, look at the tumor and we can look close enough to make the diagnosis. And I think any pathologist would tell you this is a, um, an ulcerated lesion from um, the uh, face and you'd recognize a nodular basal cell carcinoma. Now what the plastic surgeon uh, wants to know is, okay, uh, pathologist, tell me what my margins look like. So we're going to start, and you watch, I'm moving. This is live um, scan. The scan machine, the M8, is 40 miles away and we can now look at the margins. And um, I can roll my finger on the uh, mouse wheel and make it larger. So we're starting at a lateral edge. Here's the black ink along the base here. We see tumor. We see the free margin here. The black ink is the deep margin. We keep moving the uh, slide sideways. And now what you're viewing is <clears throat> As you can see the tumor, you can see the fat and some skeletal muscle here uh, at the uh, base. And so far, everything looks good. Uh, the surgeon has gotten underneath the basal cell carcinoma. And as we slide along here, we can see a clear margin all the way. Uh, you can see the scanner is actively uh, reconstituting the image, but this is all live. It's all being done on the M8 uh, instrument that we showed earlier in this video. <clears throat> and notice uh, all margins are clear. The detail is beautiful. Here's some basophilic degeneration of the collagen uh, in the vicinity of the basal cell carcinoma, but we have free margins. Now, if you want to um, look at this image on a large screen like I also have in my office. Here's what it uh, looks like. I'm going to adjust things. The screen sits over my microscope and it is um, 42 inches and it's a beautiful uh, image and you can see more detail because uh, the monitor's bigger. And uh, what we're going to do here uh, quickly is uh, move the image back. I was looking at um, this uh, scanned image on a small uh, monitor. Um, 
about 20 inches. Now you're looking at it on my 42 inch monitor, uh, which is um, nicer to look at because the image is bigger. But again, we're passing underneath the basal cell carcinoma. We're looking at the inked margin, and uh, here is uh, uh, one free margin. So we've demonstrated then an exquisitely uh, useful uh, image system that allows the viewer to be anywhere away from the uh, actual frozen section. That's the demonstration today. There are other applications um, that uh, would make this uh, useful. So um, this is available through Meyer Instruments in Houston, Texas. Thank you.